Okay, these videos on how to do on a DB should be pretty short this week uh, because uh, most of it's pretty similar skills to previous weeks. I'm going to show you, uh, well, we'll have, we're there we've got math. So I'll show you math this week, and this will be much shorter because you've got uh, plenty of videos to help you with um, this time. So obviously this video here um, is me finding what we're doing. This video here is how um, you should see it on your computers, hopefully, when you're doing the uh, the word things. This here is how I see it. Um, this is just a Japanese task, but it's a similar concept in terms of how to save it um, and how to edit it. This one here is basically how we can do it on DB Paint. Okay, so there's three options that we can um, do our technically worksheets. Um, and then here we've got how to make our pictures smaller because there's still a couple of people who are just giving me gigantic pictures, which is not a great issue because it takes me about 10 seconds to uh, fix. But that way they, you can see if you've actually developed a new skill by doing that. So all the videos were up here instead of me showing you how to do sort of certain things. If you've forgotten how to do it, there's the videos there to help you. Um, obviously, you'll have some uh, number sentences there to practice your lattice theory. And down here, we have our lattice theories. Okay, so um, I've got two there because uh, we've only got one lattice theory per page uh, to make it a little bit easier. Uh, so each day that you do the lattice theory, um, you'll need to just download um, those two. Um, and then depending on how you go with it, I'll add a third lattice theory with the, with the hundreds in it, um, like I did with the um, box method last week on the on Friday when I added the uh, extra. So all the information that you require there is, is there if you happen or forgotten, okay? Um, and this is what it should look like because I've, um, I've already done it for Flynn. So this, this method here is what I did on DB Paint, okay? When I go down, this is a method that I did on the paint on the computer, all right? So for the first two days, we're going to be doing a lattice theory. So that's what it's going to look like. Then for the next for the for the next part of the week we're going to be doing multiples and factors. This is what I want it to look like. So for the multiples, I'll be asking you a question: Is seventy five a multiple of five? That would be an example, and you're going to tell me why it is or it isn't. So this is all about your strategies and thinking skills. So my answer is yes because ten times five equals fifty, and five times five equals twenty five, and fifty plus twenty five equals seventy five. So that is why five has to be a multiple of seventy five. Is three a multiple of 25? No, because eight times three equals 24, and there is only one left, so it can't be, okay? So these are the type of questions you'll get, um, and I don't really care how you tell me, but I wanna see some strategies used, powers of 10, multiplication, skip counting, whatever it may be, um, I wanna see you justify why it is a multiple and why it's not a multiple. Uh, then with our factors, all I'll do is I'll give you a number, um, and you're going to give me all the factors for that number. Okay, so for example, I've got 12 here, um, and you're going to put them in their partners. So I've got 1 and 12, they're a pair. 2 and 6, they're a pair. And 3 and 4, they're a pair for 12. For example, the number 6, we've got 1 and 6, they're together, and 2 and 3, they're together. Now remember, there will be some that I will give you that won't actually have a pair, they'll just be on their own. Um, but that is how we're going to do our weekly learning in DB on the math. So the second half of the week, if you've been doing your lattice, um, will be the multiples and factors. So this is how that needs to look. And for the, for the first half of the week, you can do your lattice theory. So it will look like that, depending on how you've done it. Uh, so as I said, I don't care how you do it, as long as I can see you're working out. Uh, that way there, you've, you've learned another skill. So that is how we're doing our math on DB. Now remember, if you've forgotten how to do things, there are all these videos up here that have been in previous weeks to show you how to do it. Okay, so hopefully um, you can show some independence and look at those. Thank you.